was a great year for me. You know, like uh, I accomplished a lot of my goals. I had a chance to to win one more time the World Championship, the G, and then become a member of the Hall of Fame of Jiu-Jitsu. It's a goal that I was, you know, planning to accomplish, and then I did. Also, I had the, you know, like uh, the opportunity to fight in ADCC, the biggest uh, grappling tournament in the world. So the Olympics of uh, grappling, and then. Uh, I did very well, and then I trained really hard for that, and then I also I got the gold medal. I won, so it was a great year for me, 2013. Also, I have a baby girl came out in December, so unforgettable year. That was great. Uh, 2014, I'm very looking forward to compete at uh, World Abu Dhabi, the World Pro in Abu Dhabi, and then also the World Championship. I'm looking forward to get my fifth tire and then become like a five times uh, five times. World champion. I'm training really hard for that. I'm very focused, and then I can't wait to, you know, go up there and then put my game on, and then perform well, and then try to bring one more gold, and then uh, to my career. You know, like a Pan Ams, I didn't compete. I was focusing my team. You know, like uh, just today here, I have five Pan American champions, five gold medalists. I have three purple belts, one blue belt, and one white belt. And then I have another guys, you know. So the, my team did very well. I'm very happy with that. So I'm happy that I didn't compete and I focus on uh, in my athletes and my students to help them accomplish the goal. So they did very well. So I'm very happy with that. One of my another goals of 2014 is to help my students, my athletes accomplish their goals. You know, like they train really hard. You know, to go up there and they represent my name, represent you know, like uh, my team. You know, I have like a very strong team, you know, like in the Purple Belt Division. I have like a right train here right now. I have uh, Edwin Ajmi, Purple Belt, Featherweight. He just won Pan Ams. He's like a five times Pan American champion. I also have uh, Gabriel, uh, Gabriel Arch, so he's also just won Pan Ams Midweight. I have Pedro Araujo. He also just won Pan Ams Heavyweight, got Turn Absolute. You know, so I have David Blue Belt here. He also won Juvenile Blue Belt. So I'm trying to build up a team so they can keep my legs alive when I stop to compete, you know. So I'm very happy to help these kids, they, you know, train hard and accomplish their goals. So I hope this year they can continue the successful, like they start, and then they can really do well and then, you know, become world champions as well. My life never changed much as far as having an academy and then training. You know, like in my life, it's uh, go around my training, you know, I choose the time that I'm going to train. I choose the time that I'm going to teach. Every class that I teach, pretty much I train. You know, like I have uh, have my wife, that she pretty much does everything as far as the business of the academy. You know, I have the best staff here, I have the best instructors, they help me. So, you know, like uh, my training is pretty much the same, you know. It didn't change much. So, you should train hard twice, three times a day. You know, like teach, take care of my daughter, you know, help in home. It doesn't change much, you know. Some of the stuff, they change. Somebody that's actually normal, you know. But, uh, you know, like when you are an athlete and then you, you know, like you always ready to do anything that's possible to keep doing what you love. You know? So, for me, there's not much change. I'm still doing what I love and then it just things just got better and then keep getting better every year. So, it's all fun. I'm very happy where Jiu Jitsu, Brazilian Jiu Jitsu is, where is right now. You know, it's like a, it's really a great moment for Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. You know, like it's growing so much all over the world. You know, especially here in the United States, and especially here in Los Angeles, California. You know, all the best Jiu Jitsu guys, the best black belts are here. You know, so uh, you know, like we're here, ready to share the lifestyle, teach people, become better in life. You know, teach them like improve the Jiu Jitsu. You know, like. Uh, I don't know what's gonna happen in the next 10 years of Jiu-Jitsu. I'm looking forward for get bigger and bigger and bigger. You know, like uh, I expect in 10 years it's gonna be like a crazy. You know, so I'm very looking forward. And then, uh, you know, I'm here to also be part of them and help people. You know, like uh, live the Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu lifestyle. You know, like I really like to. You know, like when I train for a tournament, I focus on everything. You know, I you know I like to be very focused on my diet. My strength conditioner. I have a great coach, and you know, I have like a, my strength conditioner coach. His name is Leo Franco. He always, you know, help me, you know, be ready, be, you know, like a, the best shape. You know, like uh, I train here with my students every day. You know, like I have very tough train here. I'm actually I train only here in my academy for like a jiu-jitsu tournament. You know, just for ADCC I train wrestling with Coach Jacob. But you know, 
Like right now, Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu, I'm training here all day, you know, like training my students. I have some people that come up here, but you know, honestly, the guys that get me away is my students. This is my guys here, you know. I train them like a three three times a day, you know, like a, I train my purple belts, you know, like they give me a hard time. I improve, they improve, you know, so don't need to do much, you know, just train twice a day, do my strength conditioning, you know, like a, be in good shape, be focused, and then, you know, that make me like a really, you know, like a don't think much about just go up there and then perform in the tournament. Very confident always, and then I know I did my part. I know I train hard. I know I know I'm you know way to go. We are here in my my academy, Grace Bar in North Ridge. You know, the guys just finished training here. I'm here as you guys can see, take care of my baby, like uh, help her, like uh, uh, get used to the environment of Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu lifestyle. She will be on the mat soon. I hope you guys enjoy, you guys. Keep training hard. Don't play around. Train hard every day. That's it. See you guys soon. Your bow is a hidden Yeah.